All right, sticking with the Yankee theme, right, Tina Savasia? Hank Steinbrenner's team, Hank's Yanks, were practicing out in Babylon today. And from some of the scouts I know, I hear these young men are more than pretty good. You are absolutely right, Duke. In fact, one major league scout actually told me that Hank's Yanks could be the best amateur team in America. The 18 and under squad has players with diverse socioeconomic backgrounds. But with Yankees advisor Ray Negron managing these teens, success goes beyond the game of baseball. Um, because whenever you step on the field, you're not only representing Ray, you're not only representing themselves, you're representing, you know, Mr. Steinbrenner, and you're actually representing the Yankee organization. Hank's Yanks were getting through a grueling workout in Babylon as their season's about to get underway. What separates Hank's Yanks from, you know, from everybody who runs it to the coaches to the players is that we really want to take that extra step and become, you know, professional baseball players. We have kids that were gang members. Uh, we got them off the streets. Uh, so basically, it's about helping the kids out and keeping them, you know, off the streets and making them better people. You know, it's funny when somebody's a, a, when someone's on a gang. I guess they got to run a lot. And we ended up with a couple of guys who were actually world-class runners. And in turn, this year, we'll probably end up having four players drafted. So that's the bonus. What's unique about Hank's Yanks is the direct pipeline from the major leagues. Today, Mets scout Larry Izzo and Yankee scout Cesar Prespot instruct the players about both the mental and physical demands of the game. throw something like, move your feet, go get it. No bad. Next time. Here we go. Here we go. Okay. That's why. Okay. This is what I want. Light on your feet. Light on your hands. Caesar. Caesar Prescott. He helped me a lot hitting. He told me just relax. I always used to be too anxious. Always used to go out in front, but he just told me to relax. Thanks to uh, co our coach Adam Unger. He uh, helped me out a lot. Um, maybe more compact, smooth, and uh, a little more graceful. <laughs> the mission of Hank's Yanks is more than developing major leaguers. It's about preparing these players for the real world and turn them into great men. That was the vision of Hank Steinbrenner from the start, to bring direction, discipline, and focus to these players' lives. Yeah, at one point he had said to me, you know what my dad did for you? And I want to be able to continue to do that with all kids. And so this is what we do. Hank Sienks allows Ray to do is literally make dreams come true. Ray is a dream maker. George Steinbrenner made a dream come true for Ray by making him the bat boy. And what Ray does is pass that act on to all of the kids in the community. And that generosity and that life-changing act that Mr. Steinbrenner did for Ray is going to live on through him, through all the kids that he touches. And always carry yourself the right way like a Yankee would. This year's team boasts four major league prospects. Outfielder William Jerez Marte from Brooklyn, who was not in Babylon, but at an undisclosed major league workout. Catcher Alex Falcone from Freeport. Infielder Matt Duran of New Rochelle. And Nate Irving, a catcher out of Riverdale. If I'm blessed uh, and I am drafted, then I'll, I'll address that situation when it comes. But until then, uh, all I can do is hope and pray. They said I could uh, I could go pretty high. Um, I don't know what's going to happen yet because I don't think anyone does. But uh, I'm looking forward. I'm in a, and I'm excited. I'm a pretty fast catcher. I run a six seven sixty, which is like decent infield time, which is pretty good for a catcher. That's pretty my speed. I, I like my speed a lot. I can steal bases as a catcher. Not many people really expect it. They can't believe that a. Uh, Alex Rodriguez or CC Sabathia is going to talk to them the way they talk to uh, Derek Jeter and, and everybody else. They almost feel like they're real Yankees, and it's beautiful. A major league scout broke down the prospects for me. Jerez, who wasn't at practice but at a major league workout, has the talent size, and he'll sign and play, so he'll go in the early rounds. Duran could be considered a Manny Ramirez type hitter, but still has to develop his fielding. Falcone has blazing speed. You saw him running there. He can also hit. And then Irving is very smart behind the plate. He's got size, a good arm. But Duran and Irving and Falcone, uh, Falcone they have committed to colleges on full rides, so we'll see how that affects their draft position and the draft due is on June 6th. What a team. They are. And really a bunch of studs. Yeah, yeah really. Great yeah. job. Fun to watch.